Academy of Dog Grooming Training. This DVD will feature the cockapoo in a puppy trim. This DVD will be presented in easy to follow chapters beginning with restraint, equipment and the sanitary areas. Then we will be clipping the body and the legs, trimming the feet, tail and head. Coco, she's an 18 month old cockapoo. For those of you that don't know, a cockapoo is a cross between a cocker spaniel and a poodle, and consequently, the coats are a cross or a mixture rather of the two breeds. Um, this can be very, very difficult to groom if uh, unfortunately the owners don't groom the dogs simply because they have no idea what kind of coat they were taking on. Um, the ones that come to us that are matted solid are clipped off for hygiene and welfare reasons. Um, if they're fortunate, like Coco, that our owners groom her regularly, bring her to us regularly, then they look really nice in this shortish puppy trim that we're going to do. As we've said in lots of other DVDs, I don't like restraint terribly of dogs on the table. I don't like to see them strung up like chickens. So she's not going to have any neck strap or belly band or any of that. She's going to be freestanding on the table uh, so that she's comfortable and feels a bit more confident. I have already attended to the clipping of the sanitary and hygiene areas. We have clipped the groin area. The, around, sweetheart. the anal area, pads of the feet, and the insides of her ears. Come on, darling. There you go. The insides of her ears have just been lightly clipped around the ear canal. Uh, the nature, again, of the two breeds together means that they have pendulous ears with lots and lots of coat. And if there's too much hair here, it can interfere with the airflow down into the ear canal and we can have all sorts of um, ear problems. So we keep the airflow going just by taking away some of the coat around the ear canal itself. Coco's also been bathed and blow dried and of course her toenails have been trimmed.